Hey golfers, welcome back to the Second Swing YouTube channel. My name is Michael Geiger. I'm sitting here with Mr. Larry Bobka, master fitter here at Second Swing. Larry, today we're talking about putter fitting, something you've done countless times. Right. We're talking about kind of the big variables that come into play in a putter fitting. Now, obviously there's the putter itself with all the, the different, the loft, the shaft, the head shape, and then there's, of course, the golfer and their stroke. What are kind of the main variables that you think about uh, when you think about a, a putter fitting? Well, usually when somebody's putting poorly, um, you know, they're having speed issues. Well, the number one variable, and we've done the Quintech videos yep. before, and it, it's loft, without a doubt. Because if the ball's not coming off the face of the putter correctly, it's going to create backspin, it's going to create side spin. Mm -hmm. It's also going to create, if, if I've got too much loft on this putter for my putting stroke, I'm not going to hit the center of the face. So that's usually the player that walks in and says, man, I ask him, hey, how do you hit your putts? you hit your putts solid? No. Well, it's a putt. You should be able to hit it solid, right? Right. Well, that's the first, that is the number one thing we'll address is we'll take a look at the loft. We'll see what they bring in. And then from there, we can start making the adjustments. Then we're talking, you know, we go from loft, length of the putter. Mm -hmm. Lie angle's kind of a third because, you know, we've all seen... Um, in the old days, Seve Ballesteros, Hideki just won, yep. just won in Hawaii, and he had the toe of the putter off, off the ground because that's the way he wants it to look. You know, and then we've seen, you know, Payne Stewart won the U.S. Open where the heel was up, Steve Stricker Steve putts Stricker. with the yep. heel up. So it's kind of a secondary thing because people want to put the putter down, players want to put it down where it looks comfortable. Mm -hmm. But loft and length for sure. And then you kind of get into the weight of the putter. And everybody says, well, what about the, what do you mean of weight of the putter? Well, this is a Scotty Cameron Newport putter. You know, the head weight's going to be around 340, 345 grams, regular steel shaft. Well, now you've got Odyssey, who does their Stroke Lab mm -hmm. version, where the head weight's actually heavier. They take 40 grams out of the shaft. So the balance of the putter is going to feel totally different. And in somebody's hands, I mean, I grab this and go, oh, that feels great. Oh, this one, that head feels way too heavy. And it's the opposite. People might go, wow, you know, I just, I want, I want to feel the head more. I want to right. feel the head more. And especially in this day and age of everybody putting larger grips on there, you know, that was part of the reason that they went to this at Odyssey. So. Now there's another variable. So all I can say is the best thing to do is come in, get fit. You know, we'll find the loft that you need. We'll find the length you need. We'll find the head style because mm -hmm. we haven't even talked about mallets and blades. Yep. And, but at least we get the parameters down that we know you're going to roll the ball well. Then we can make an intelligent choice between a mallet, an Odyssey putter, a uh, Scotty Cameron putter, a blade, because now we're getting you to ball, roll the ball well, and now we can get the feeling of hitting it, and you can really feel the, the ball coming off the putter, mm -hmm. the center of the putter face. You know, it's kind of like if I, if I fit you for a driver, and I gave you a tailor-made 9 degree, and a Titleist 10 and a half degree, and a Ping 12 degree. Mm -hmm. Well, that's not going to be a very good fitting because you're going to hit one low, one medium, one high. You're not really going to feel, well, that's what happens with putting. Right. And people don't understand that. So, yeah, definitely, definitely loft. And then from there, we work on the length and all the parameters. And it's obvious that there's a lot more to a putter than people think. Right. And I think the putting, the putter fittings are so important because it, it's probably the most feel-oriented club in the bag. Absolutely. It's the only shot that's played on the ground. And I think it, it's so player to player, it's so different. When you think about it, at something like loft, I tend to hold my hands a little behind the ball. That's yep. something that I'm working on. So my effective loft is so much different than a player who naturally yeah. has a big forward press. So Absolutely. something like that, that might be you know six, seven degree difference. That's why it's so important to come in and, and get a fitting. Right, and that's why we're you know we we've we've got a Quintec here in our Minnesota store, but we're putting a new one in our Scottsdale store. And in fact, we just bought. Quintex for every store. So around the country, we're going to have Quintex fitting centers in all our stores. So we're really going to we're really going to kill it this year with putting for putter fittings. Absolutely. I think those that's such a key point. 
anywhere in the uh, anywhere in the country that has a second swing location. You can come in, get a Quintech fitting, and you can experience kind of all these these variables that may seem to complicate the putter fitting process. Talk to one of our second swing fitters. They'll simplify everything. They'll find you a putter that will have you making more putts. Larry, thank you again for your time. You're welcome. Thanks for watching.